This remote controlled robot with a nose mounted camera turns right and left, moves up and down, and even flies through a ring, all on commands from a controller who uses a special instrument. And what is this instrument? The controller's mind. Here at the University of Minnesota, Professor Bin He and his team have engineered a non-invasive system called a brain-computer interface that allows a person to control a robot using only their thoughts. Dr. He's team includes Alex Dowd and Carl Lafleur. For example, if you imagine making a fist with your right hand, it turns the robot to the right. And if you imagine making a fist with both hands, it moves the robot up. Here's how it works. When the controller imagines a movement without actually moving, specific neurons in the brain's motor cortex produce electric currents. These currents are detected by electrodes in an EEG cap, which sends the signals to the computer. The computer translates the signal pattern into a command and beams it to the robot via Wi-Fi. In this case, turn right. This brain-computer interface technology is all about helping people with a disability or various neurodegenerative disease to help them regain mobility, independence, and enhance performance. We envision they use this technology to help control wheelchair, artificial limb, or other devices. This has tremendous potential for people who can't move or speak. And the best part is... It's completely non-invasive. Nobody has to have a chip implanted in their brain to pick up the neuronal activity. We're very proud to have taken this step towards that goal.